so in today's video is gonna be how i stretched my hair with yarn instead of african threading before doing my shocking losing twist from my recent video so all i'm going to do is just grab that strand of my hair then i will start um threading it from the roots if you guys noticed i didn't really like tighten um the root of my hair before i started threading it downward because i don't want to add tension on my scalp to avoid unnecessary breakage and hair shedding so as you guys can see i will continue doing the same thing just threading threading and threading and the reason why i actually uh, did um the, the stretching force for doing my shocking losing twist is that getting my hair stretched before doing the twist is gonna make my my twist look more beautiful and fluffy and stretch out beside i wanted to like carry my my twist for a longer period so it is a must for me to get my hair stretched before doing the twist on my hair so when i get to the ends of my hair i will start threading it upward again before i make a loop to get my hair secured so it doesn't unravel uh, while i'm sleeping as you can see me doing yeah you're gonna have to make a loop if you don't want your your threading to unravel to keep uh, your threading protected so i believe i left my threading for like a few days like two to three days before on arrival then so yeah i truly love it it was nice because you guys know i don't really stress my hair concerning hair styles so after two to three days i arrival my hair though you can see my hair i have combed um almost my hair out of camera but i loved um this particular strand to show you guys what i normally do after taking out my my trident because for me this part is crucial because you know taking out your trading then after you start combing your hair and if your hair is not well moisturized you're gonna break your hair and in this uh, process i didn't want hair breakage so i'm just like trying to separate my hair gradually with my hand then i'm gonna spray my hand with some water but while doing this process make sure the water you're going to spray in your hand is a very little water you don't want your hair to revert bad so you don't want to like apply too much water on your hair so i'll go ahead and rub it through my hair as you guys can see me doing i will start like gently separating then afterward i'll go ahead and apply my cream this is the cream i use the one i used uh, in my in my previous video on my twist so i'm going to use the same cream so i'm going to like apply to the ends of my hair first before i start working it through the reason why i normally focus on my on my hands the ends of my hair are the most fragile part and these are the place i want to focus on because if i don't focus on them on the ends carefully and i'm gonna like lose that length that i have achieved you know and it would be easier for me to like have um breakage or uh, for my ends to be very tango and knocked out and you guys are going to see in this video that i was struggling a little bit combing my hair in the ends because my hands were very rough but i will i will go ahead and dust my ends i will just take the advantage since i've already stretched my hair to keep my hands cleaned up because i love keeping my ends clean to avoid any knocks because if i don't clean up my my ends this knot that i have can travel all the way to the root of my hair and this can cause me a lot of damage so it doesn't worth it guys if you have knocks in your hair don't be afraid to dust 
your ends uh, it's better than you just cutting a huge part you can like dust your hands gradually and this is gonna reduce uh, too much knocks in your hands if you find out uh, that the ends are not getting better while dusting then you can go ahead and trim your hair so the comb i was using to comb my hair at the beginning was a wood comb and that is the hair that came out from that particular hair strand so what i'm going to do now i'm going to start dusting my hands as i said and i'm not afraid to dust my hands i prefer doing this instead of me leaving all the knocks in my hands so i'm just gonna like grab a uh, strand by strand then i will dust it up so to be frank and sincere i have been natural for the past uh six years and few months and i have learned during these years that as she even learned you don't have to like trim your hair all the time because trimming your hair all the time decreases your length retention so i will be using uh, my white tooth comb to like try to comb my hair to get rid of any shed hair as i was saying trimming your hair all the time does not make your hair grow faster i want you to have that in mind because that is another trick so i went ahead again to use another white tooth comb like to smooth everything up because i don't want any any shed hair left in my hair or any knots so i'm just trying like to smooth that um yeah uh, this is just what that came out from my hair my hair didn't break either because i was doing that very gentle so i'm just gonna like dust everything that is left because i have to get rid of that knot now I'm just gonna like twist it up and yeah so let me know how you take care of your hair I will also know how you take care of your hair if there is anything you want me to share with you um we'll be so glad to do that and uh, this is why I love sharing my hair journey to also help anyone that is struggling growing their hair I am also giving you guys the little things I do, the tricks, the all the details because I don't want to keep them with myself, you know? Because keeping them with myself uh, is not going to like help anybody. So I prefer sharing it with you guys. And I want to also thank every one of you that have subscribed to my channel. Like you guys are truly, truly amazing. Like I truly appreciate you from the bottom of my heart and i love you so much guys so this is the finish up of my hair and this is what came out of my hair from that particular hair strand now i'm going to show you guys what came out of my entire hair while coming so my loves see you very soon in my next video bye bye